In this chapter, we will show you how to create a perspective 3D document. We will use the Marquee Tool selection and the 3D Cutting Planes function to set a smart perspective building detail view. The PLA file contains a building part of a multi-story building with only two stories and a couple of rooms. Let's start and activate the first preset view located in the Chapter 1 folder. In this view, you can see the partial floor plan with dashed lines at the boundaries. Activate the next preset view. This window shows a preset perspective view from the outside of the building. Switch to the next preset view to zoom in on the floor plan. Select the Marquee tool. Make sure that the Thick All Floors Selection method is activated. Draw a rectangular selection from point 1 to point 2. Click the right button on the floor plan window and select the Show Selection in 3D from the context menu, or simply just use the F5 button shortcut to switch to the 3D window. Go to Window Menu, Toolbars, and open the 3D Visualization Toolbar. Click on the 3D Cutting Planes icon. On this palette, you will see the schematic model part in three windows with the three main orientations. We will cut the model horizontally on the second floor. Click on the top right window and draw a line by clicking from the left side to the right side in the middle of the second floor. Hold down the shift key before you finish the line to keep it horizontal. When you click on the right side, an eye cursor will be activated. Click above the line to remove the top part of the model. You can then choose a custom material for cut elements or you can use element attributes. Choose the right one now and then press OK to leave the dialog. To activate the 3D cut and remove the selected model part, click on the 3D cutaway icon. The selected model part won't be removed but will just be hidden and can be easily unhidden for later use. Switch to the project map in the navigator. Let's now save the 3D document. There are three options to do this. The first option is to go to Document, 3D Document, Create 3D Document. The second is to right-click with the mouse and select the Capture Window for 3D Document from the Context menu. The third option is to select the 3D Document in the Navigator, right-click with the mouse, and choose New 3D Document. Enter 01 for the ID and perspective for the name. The new 3D document will be created and stored under the 3D documents in the Navigator project map. As you can see, you can pan and zoom in this window, but you can't orbit and rotate the model. If you need another viewpoint, you can save a new one or just modify this view. To set the viewpoint of this window, click on the 01 perspective with the right mouse button and choose Open Source View. This will open the original 3D window where the view has been stored. Set a new arbitrary viewpoint. Then right-click again on the 01 Perspective 3D document and select Redefine from the context menu. You will get a warning message, but go ahead and click on Redefine anyway. The modified 3D Perspective document has been stored.